She's been blessed with one of the most beautiful voices in the world, but Celine Dion has faced numerous tragedies throughout her life. From medical issues that have threatened to derail her career, to the tragic deaths of loved ones, these heartbreaking moments will bring a tear to the eye of her many fans. Given Dion's phenomenal success and perseverance in an industry in which it's so easy to fail, you may be surprised at the adversity and circumstances this amazing singer has had to face. These are some of Celine Dion's many tragic struggles. Love of her life Dion's husband and manager, René Angelil, lost his battle with throat cancer in January 2016, two days before his 74th birthday. According to Billboard, Angelil and Dion began dating when Dion was 19 years old. They were married in December 1994 in a lavish ceremony in Montreal, the same church at which Angelil's funeral was held. According to People magazine, after Angelil's passing, a grief-stricken Dion told the crowd at her Las Vegas show, "'He's always been on stage with me, and nothing will ever change that.'" Tragedy strikes twice in a devastating twist of events, Dion's brother, Daniel Dion, died of complications from cancer just two days after Rene Angelil's death. Daniel was 59 years old. Celine attended the memorial for Daniel the day after her husband was laid to rest. She didn't attend Daniel's funeral two days later because, as Entertainment Tonight reported, she and her children could not continue two more days of public mourning. The singer has thankfully arrived at a place of peace while coming to terms with their deaths. Telling People in May 2016, Rene escorted my brother. It was perfect. Rene took him under his wings and he said, you know, I'll take good care of him." Decades of Medical Troubles Prior to his death, Angelil's health had been an ongoing issue for nearly 20 years. According to People, he was first diagnosed with cancer in 1999. In response to the diagnosis, Dion put the music business on hold at the height of her career so she could care for her husband. After a reported 38 rounds of chemotherapy and radiation, Angelil was declared cancer-free in 2000. Angelil battled throat cancer a second time in 2013. According to the Las Vegas Sun, he underwent a successful surgery and was once again said to be in full remission. However, in August 2014, the couple confirmed that Angelo was fighting the illness again. Dion put both her Las Vegas residency and upcoming tour on hold to be with her ailing husband. Long Road to Motherhood Throughout her marriage, Dion and Angelil struggled to have children. The couple turned to in vitro fertilization treatments to conceive all three of their sons. One of their biggest struggles came in 2009, when Dion and Angelil suffered a miscarriage. Despite the heartbreak, Dion kept an optimistic outlook when speaking to Oprah Winfrey a month later. It's life, you know? Uh -huh. um, a lot of people go through this, uh -huh. but it's not being told, told because it's not in newspaper and she wasn't ready to give up just yet. We tried four times to have a child. We're still trying. We're on the fifth try, and I tell you, if five is my lucky number, this fifth try has got to come in. Ah! Right? In a happy turn of events, the couple announced in May 2010 that they were expecting twins. Dion's twin sons, Nelson and Eddie, were born October 23, 2010. Struggles with her instrument in February 2012, Dion was forced to cancel several months of performances for her Las Vegas residency due to issues with her vocal cords following a viral illness, as UPI reported. Dion was put on six to eight weeks of vocal rest, and her show did not resume until June that year. It's hard to do a show, but it's much harder to cancel shows. We disappointed a lot of people. It, it was hard. Despite the health scare, Dion revealed on the Today Show that she wasn't afraid of losing her ability to sing because her family is her most treasured accomplishment. I don't depend on my success and my singing. Don't get me wrong, I love what I do, but I don't hold on to that. It's a good thing Dion has that perspective, since another medical condition in her ear that required surgery kept her from the stage for nearly a month in early 2018. She addressed the setback on her Facebook page, writing in part, I apologize to everyone who planned to travel to Las Vegas to see my show. I know how disappointing this is, and I'm so sorry. 